Einstein, Rosen, Podolsky, and later Penrose all joined Schrodinger's call for reason. In 1957, physicist Hugh Everett had a daring idea. What if the wave never collapses? Instead, every possible outcome happens, but in separate branching universes. In one universe, you open the box and the cat lives. In another, you open it and the cat is dead. Both outcomes are real, just no longer connected. And it's not just the cat. Every quantum event splits reality endlessly. You make a choice and the universe makes copies. Every you exists in a separate branch, unaware of the others. Everett's many worlds theory is mathematically clean, but it raises more questions. Why only certain branches? Why can the cat only be dead or alive? Why can't we test it? Even so, it's a mind-expanding way to imagine quantum reality, Everett's way of freeing physics from paradox, and the cat from being frozen in time, both dead and alive at once. In the next part, we will see what modern physics suggests is the best solution for the famous cat, Penrose's theory of objective collapse. Thanks for listening. Mwah!